internet. It is Thursday the 15th of August 2019. I'm down here at my favorite place, Crookhaven Heads, right at the headlands. It's a beautiful winter's day. No jumper needed. I brought my hoodie, my sweater, my cardigan. Don't need a jumper at all. I've even brought my toque. Don't need that. It is blazingly warm. The perfect, whoa, look what I'm standing on. The perfect weather to crack open a beverage. Now I've got a very special beverage for you today. Any ideas what you think this beverage may be? Now you know it's gonna be a Jack Daniels, but what do you think it is? I'll give you three seconds. One, two, three. Look what I've got here. Country Cocktails in Australia. This is a US only release. This is the latest variety, Southern Citrus. Now this deserves sitting down, I think. How have I managed to nab country cocktails from Jack Daniels when they're only available in the USA? Well, I've got to thank a giver. Now, I'm not going to name names here. A giver, a very, very generous giver, sent me two varieties, the latest Southern Citrus and Lynchburg Lemonade. Today, we're going to be looking at the Southern Citrus version only. That giver sent me two bottles of this, which is awesome because you know me, I keep one for posterity and one for the review. So the one I'm gonna open is actually already opened, which sounds strange because this is a review, but I'll explain. So these go through the luggage hold on a plane, the mail area, the luggage area, it's not compressed. Now, as you can see, it's only a crown seal on top there. The crown seal on the other one, which is chilling right now, did uh, not seal correctly and we lost half of the contents unfortunately so that's the one I'm gonna be consuming from this beverage is not a fizzy drink anyway it's not like we're gonna lose any carbonation by having it already opened in the plane flying all over the Pacific Ocean and across the Tasman Sea and into Australia it's just that it hasn't got the same quantity which kind of sucks but that's the way it is. So here's the one where the seal didn't quite work during transit. That's how much we've lost. Let's crack the seal even further and have a taste. That's definitely a unique flavor. All right, here we go, folks. Country cocktails in Australia, Southern Citrus. Wow, wow, all right, okay. This is nothing at all like I expected. It's obviously a sweet flavor. Like I said, there's no carbonation in there. It's totally citrusy. You can taste that like peachy, lemony, citrusy, acidic-y. Now I'm going very gently on this because I wanna pour some into a glass and have a look at it as well. It's really, really flavorsome. Now look, 4.8% by volume. In Australia, that's regarded as a regular beverage, whereas in America, the way this is branded is a light alcoholic beverage, a light alcoholic beverage. If you're watching this from Australia and you're wondering about that, most of our alcoholic uh, pre-mixed beverages are around about 4.5, 4.8, 5% total. It's just interesting that they regard this as a light beverage. I also regard it as a light alcohol beverage, but uh, as far as the rules and the regulations here in Australia, this is a regular content alcohol beverage. Fresh taste, serve cold. Now there is some interesting things on the labeling here I wanna talk about. First of all, this is bizarre. It says flavored Beer, flavored beer? This is not beer. Beer is like barley, hops, malt, wheat, water, sugar, yeast. That is a, such a strange thing to see on the, on the label there. Flavored beer. Another strange thing which you would note if you were the uh, perceptive kind like I am. Brewed and bottled by Jack Daniels Beverage Co in Louisville, Kentucky. Not the Jack Daniels Distillery in Lynchburg, Tennessee. Huh? So what we have here is, this is what I think anyway, I don't know for any fact, but what I think's going on here is the Jack Daniels whiskey comes from Lynchburg, Tennessee, from the distillery. They make their pre-mixed country cocktails, in this case, in Kentucky. There you go, at a place called the Jack Daniels Beverage Co, separate to the distillery. There you go. Now what I really wanna do here is I wanna pour this into a glass and hold it up to the sky and have a look at it. 
So as you can see, it is a very chalky, milky, white viscosity. I am savoring every last drop of this because this is the only one I've got here. It's just so incredible to have this in Australia. I am blessed to have the givers, such cool people to support me and do this. Now I have tried many, many, many times to go through the correct avenue to obtain these products to review in Australia and I've kind of hit almost a dead end, I suppose. So I'm thankful for the givers coming through and, and getting these products to me for these reviews. I'm completely blown away by the generosity and the, I'm gonna use the L word, the love. I appreciate it so much. You know who you are. Thank you very, very much. This is incredible to taste, incredible to review. There are so many Jack Daniels products out there. I am thrilled to be able to bring these to you guys and show you what they're all about. Talk a little about them, compare them. Next week sometime, I will crack out the Lynchburg Lemonade and then there are seven other varieties out there and I will do the best I can to obtain those and bring the reviews to you as well. In the meantime, I'm gonna savor this. Oh yeah, wow. Hey, by the way, you see the ocean behind me? Let me get back up here. You see that behind me? That's the Tasman Sea. Just around the bend here is Culborough Beach. You know me and surfing. I went surfing yesterday. First surf back since the Away of a Day Project Winter Edition has completed. The swell was kind of closing out. I didn't really get any long rides, but it was just good to be back up on the board riding after a week off or so. Look at this guy, big fat Australian seal. Now I don't want to get too close. I don't want to get between the seal and the water. I want to have him have, or her, have an easy access to escape if they feel they need to. So I could probably go along here. Now we do have some very strange animals here in Australia. That is certainly, that's not a strange animal. You see these all over the world, but uh, it's just nice to have a big fat one chilling out right there, Crookhaven head style. Now the thing that I really love about doing these beverage reviews is that I come outside into the Aussie outdoors and showcase you scenery while consuming a beautiful beverage. Now you guys can get this, in America anyway, you guys can get this anywhere, right? But how many of you can do this? Sitting down here in beautiful Aussie scenery like this. Not many, so I'm thrilled to be able to bring you this via this. Does that make sense? That's why I like doing this outdoors. I like coming out, sitting down, bringing ice, bringing a glass, having a look at seals. A lot of you will never get a chance to come to Australia, so I'm here to showcase that to you. Cheers to that. Let me finish this guy. Wow, Southern Citrus, country cocktail. And speaking of being in the Australian outdoors and showing it to you guys, well, a young gentleman just turned up. He said, you're sitting here doing a drink review when we could be out on our boat doing the review, looking back at the land. He's gone to get his boat now. So let's wait for him to come back and then let's get out there onto the boat, show you the beautiful Tasman Sea looking back at Crookhaven Heads. Oh, that's um, we're out of time. I know, I know, I know, I 
I keep running out of time on my own channel. You think I'd get that checked out by now, right? Hey, look, if you like what you've seen here on the channel and you want to contribute financially, there's plenty of ways to do that in the description field of this video. And if you haven't done this already and you want to make sure you don't miss any of my future uploads, hit the subscribe button here. You can also check out my previous vlog here or a random vlog there. And you can become a patron of mine here. What's that? No, 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 I'm busy with my end slate. I'm busy with my end slate. I'll be with you in a few seconds. A few more seconds. A few more seconds is all I require. All right, I'm coming now.